way to uh, Wizard World Chicago, and we're filming an Event 360. We are simultaneously filming for Event 360, and we're live on Facebook. We'll see you there. Uh, should be a fun drive. Uh, Man is back there, ready to take a nap. See you soon. What's up, buddy? So, we got parked. Now, Panda's getting ready, Jake's getting ready, I'm getting ready. About to go piss in the woods. About to go piss in the woods. The uh, thing here, uh, Wizard World Chicago. Yep. Not enough bathrooms. We have so much cosplay stuff. Like, the majority of our luggage was cosplay stuff. It's gonna look weird when I walk out of the woods with my bow and arrow and quiver to take a piss. Yes. Same thing, I'm gonna go out there and hunt. Yes, we're excited to get into the actual convention, though. Right, Amanda? Yeah. All right. Things are a little tight. So, uh, you'll see us soon in the convention. I think I'm in the shot. If I'm in the shot, it's terrible. That's all I know. Yeah. I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's this perfect, a uh, ton of background noise, but this perfect little hole where you can see Jake pissing what in the woods. Doing? Do you see him? Wave your hands, Jake. Hey, what I can do. Right there, there he is. There's him. That's him peeing in the woods, right there. I'm like up on the top floor of this parking garage dangling my camera over it in a completely unsafe way. So I'm gonna stop doing that. Hey, okay, it's really loud on the show floor. We just got here, we're gonna try to interview some people. Uh, yeah, try to interview some people. We got Marceline behind me, I think I just spit on the camera. Uh, we're, we're gonna lose Amanda all over the place. But uh, yeah, stay tuned, we're gonna find some people. <laughs> which is awesome. Less stress for me, I get to support a friend and get rid of the stigma because it doesn't matter where your cosplay comes from as long as you have fun. Uh, her name that she goes by on the internet is Kainoa K. Uh, her name is Becky and she's incredible and she's out of Portland. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to be a uh, rogue from the classic 90s cartoon with the big hair and everything. Uh, and then I'll be a new version of Daenerys made by somebody else on <laughs> I'm Ryan, I am Todd Ingram with 30 Lux, and I'm also pretty much just an assortment of MC Sports clothing apparel and then a pawn shop bass guitar that she painted. So, Which actually looks really good. Sure. We are the Nerd Rage Podcast. We talk about everything from pop culture to movies to television shows that involve anything related to comic book characters, DC, Marvel, or other. So please give us a look. There we go. Can I ask me questions? Alright, so tell me your, uh, your names and what your cosplay is. Uh, my name is Kat. I am the female Cyclops. <laughs> my name is Drew. I am Remy the Bull, aka Gambit from the X Men. How did you make your costumes? Okay, say your name and your character. My name is Lauren, and I'm Nebula from Guardians of the Galaxy. I'm Rachel, and I'm from Lauren. Okay, so how'd you make your costumes? Um, um, long story. Yeah. Um, I bought the elastic pants, and I have my cowboy boots that I painted with acrylic paint and latex. And I sewed fabric to make the small, minor details. My art piece is made completely out of Warbla and like a fourth inch thick EVA phone. My swords are made out of little kid squirt guns that I sawed off the edge of and did a, uh, I can't think, a chain and spray painted the chain and pretty much sewed every minor detail that you see. And my eye is made out of latex, my eyepiece. And what kind of uh, paint do you have on you there? Um, I am using Evron cake makeup and she is also so how'd you make yours? Well, I'm not as skilled as her, but I bought the costume, like the main bodysuit, and then I made the belt out of just like some fabric and Velcro, and then these came with it. The boots, I'm wearing just regular tall boots and have the boot covers over. Uh, this I made out of foam and formula, and then this is also formula. Is that a wig? Yeah. 
part of it. Part of it. Yep. This is my real hair right here. The part with the pink is the wig. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, just tell me your name and how you made it. Hi, my name's Mike. Um, I actually just went to Party City and I got a plastic ball. I filled it up with a few LED lights connected to a battery pack and some holographic uh, wrapping paper. Nice. I think it looks great. Uh, and did you make the rest of your costume yourself? Um, yeah, I, I did, actually. Oh, nice, nice. I, um, no, I mean, I just kind of looked at different designs they had online, and I called them pretty straightforward. Thank you, Mike. We're, we're about a whole hour into the con. Already exhausted. Amanda's going for the booze already. Yeah, and you can see the wild panda's going for booze. Wild panda, and and she's getting what she she's after here at the uh, Shady Eye Saloon. Pretty awesome. Uh, it's Kelvin and Hubs cosplay gaming and hilarity, and I am well Finn. <laughs> I'm Andrew, and I'm from Uncharted. Nice. He's Nathan Drake. <laughs> I like your uh, gym. What is that made out of, by the way? Oh, uh, this is plastic. Just plastic. Yeah, okay. PLA. Nice. All right, take it easy, guys. Thank you. Cocktails and cosplayers from 48. So, what's your name? I'm Moncho. And uh, what are you cosplaying as? I am. Uh, my own. So how'd you uh, make your costume? Um, both with a lot of thermal plastics, uh, stretchy, four-way stretch fabric, and patience. Can, uh, can I see your bracers? How long did it take you to make it? Uh, about a week, a week and a half. So, a week and a half? Yeah. You work fast. A little bit. Everyone else I've interviewed is like months and months. I've been doing this for 17 years. So, so yeah, you're a pro then, right? A little bit. A little bit. I've been at it for a while. All right, thank you very much. Tell me your name and what's your cosplay as? Oh, my name is Mark. I'm uh, Jean Grey. How'd you make your costume, Mark? Um, I went to Johnny Brock's thinking Comic Con was last weekend and bought everything. <laughs> and uh, then realized I just, it's not till this weekend. I just gotta get this rear view. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Man, How'd you, you talk make? about making it in the car. <laughs> oh, yeah, I mostly made it in the car on the way here. So. Really? <laughs> oh, yeah, it was pretty awesome. Yeah. So what about you? How'd you make yours? Uh, my name is Matt. I made mine pretty much with foam and uh, duct tape and a lot of stuff. I made it, you know, spot the rest pretty much. Oh, huh, nice. About it. How long did it take you? This took about three hours. A lot did of painting, a lot of mesh and all that. You can even see on the inside. You can see out, but they can't see in, so. Oh, nice. It's not bad. You didn't make it on the way here in the car? No, I actually took my time. There's no way I would have been able to. <laughs> I take a picture. All right. Thank you. All right, so end of Wizard World Chicago, day one, Friday. We're mostly just exhausted from the drive up here. Extra loud. We've been here for about, what, three and a half hours? Yeah, not even really all that long. And we're ready to retire our first cosplays. Better ones coming Saturday. We'll get a lot more interviews, a lot more awesome pictures, maybe see a panel or two. Otherwise, I'll see you guys later. Tell me about the Harley Quinn drinking game. Uh, we were going to start our Harley Quinn drinking games and take a picture of every individual Harley Quinn that we saw no doubles and take a drink for every harlequin we saw. We backed out of that in five minutes because we saw six. So if you're looking for something innovative and new to do, harlequin is uh, definitely right at the top. Nobody's doing that. And Panda is retiring her uh, Marceline, the battle vampire queen for the day. Uh, I'll be happy to take off my armor and, and we have, be wearing a comfy cosplay tomorrow. Yeah, we have two new cosplays that we're going to be doing tomorrow. Much easier to deal with. It's Props and like here, hold this, no, hold this, hold that. So, no props. 
Alright, made it back to the hotel on night one. We're going to uh, set this up. I'll probably edit some videos over there. We'll watch uh, TakeOver Brooklyn over here. Um, all the Noi Panda yes, over here. Food. Definitely, we're going to look at Starting. food. I think Amanda's. There's a Hooters nearby. We can go there. Ooh, Hooters. We didn't see enough boobs today at Comic-Con. Yep, sure didn't. We saw enough Harley Quinns. Look at this shower, though. I'm excited. Yeah, there's some places nearby that are, like, not super expensive. Okay, yeah, so, uh, keep in touch. I haven't even opened this closet yet. Um, I don't know what any of this is. It's like a laptop. Is there a robe in there? It's like a safe. No, no robe. Um, but there's wine glasses in the bathroom, which is weird. There's a Thai place. Oh, nice. There is a Chinese place. Jake's farting. Stinking up the room already. I'm gonna start it. All right, we're gonna cosplay tomorrow. Cami, Guile, and Kyle Drogo. All right, we'll probably, you know, film some more hotel room shenanigans later.